Hey everyone, welcome back. So today we are doing a massive Rue 21 haul. I wanted to redo or do another one, uh, Rue 21 haul, because I kind of wanted to see how consistent they were. I said before um, in my past Boohoo haul that I feel like Boohoo is kind of a hit or miss. Sometimes you really like what you get and sometimes you really don't, or there are a number of pieces you like and number of number of pieces you don't like. I don't feel like Boohoo is necessarily super, super consistent. And so I wanted to see how consistent Route 21 was, if I just got really, really lucky with my first haul and everything that I really liked, or if it was actually really consistent, good quality things. Um, and so I decided to place another order for you guys to also know too, so you could feel comfortable with ordering too, because sometimes it's scary to order online if you don't have a Rue 21 close to you, or maybe you want certain things that are only sold online and you just don't know the consistency. So um, I decided to purchase a whole bunch of other stuff, and I did range in different things. So I have a pair of shoes, I have a pair of leggings, I have a dress, I have all different sorts of things in here that you guys are going to see. So I hope that you're excited get comfy because I'm sure this is going to be a long one because I'm long-winded. But also first, I know I'm not looking the best today. I don't know what it is. I feel like I've been fighting cold or a sinus infection or something for like three weeks now. And you just know those days, no matter how hard you try with your makeup, it just, you just don't look super fresh. That's how I feel. So please cut me some slack. Anyway, I have the receipt so I can show you how much everything was and um, I got a total of 17 items and everything was under $200. So that was super, super good. I definitely recommend only shopping their sales. I feel like their clothes are definitely worth the sale prices um, because otherwise things can get a little pricey. And I recommend ordering online, maybe going to store and seeing how their sales are there or just looking to see what you really like and then ordering online because I feel like you get better discounts online as always you can find, always find promo codes. I always get a promo code. That I can find. So definitely Google promo, like Route 21 promo code, because you should you should be always be able to like find one. So the first two things I'm going to show you, I've already worn. One of these things I just washed. The other thing I haven't done my whites yet, so it's a little dirty. So don't judge me. But um, I got this shirt. It says Warrior, not Warrior. As you can tell, it's really wrinkly, as well as I think that there's some ice cream stains on it. Anyway. Um, I really, really liked this top because I actually deal with really bad anxiety. Um, it's sometimes really crippling, and I just thought this was a good mantra to tell myself, you know, like to tell, I'm a warrior, I'm not a warrior. Working on it, working on it. Anyway, I ordered a size up in this because I thought that it was going to be more of a tighter fitting shirt, and it's actually really, really big, as you can see in the try on haul. But I find it to be really comfortable and I actually don't mind how big it is. It may not be the most flattering thing, but I think it's really comfortable and I really, really like it. Um, I like the rolled up cuff sleeves. I think that adds a little something. I like. I just like the way it's cut. I think it looks really nice on the body. Um, so yeah, I was really happy and pleased with this. This top was... Um, originally $14.99 and I paid $7.80 with tax with it. So, definitely like this. Would recommend. Would recommend. The next thing I got that I was wearing in that try-on haul were these pants. Now, I remember having a pair of like Adidas brand of these pants back when I was like eight. But they were the ones that buttoned and you could just like rip them off, you know, like they buttoned all the way down the leg. They were like totally cool. It feels weird that I'm wearing stuff I used to wear when I was a kid. Um, but these are super, super comfortable. So these are my first like bottoms that I purchased from Rue 21 and I bought my normal size and I didn't know sometimes things fit looser, sometimes things fit a bit big. My husband thinks these actually are a tiny bit big um, as far as they don't like grip your leg completely. Um, but I really, really like them. They're high rise, so they cover the little tummy area. They make me feel a little bit more like held in and secure. Um, I like the stripes. They have a really nice stretch and give to them. So I feel like if you could possibly order a size down, then you could. Or if you, you know, I don't feel like these are way too tight and unflattering in any way. I feel like you can order your size and be fine. Um, sometimes you never know with leggings. So I really like them. They're really soft. They washed up well. I'm excited to continue wearing these. I feel like these are perfect to wear with just like those shirts and just lounging around and being comfortable. Right 
These were originally $16.99 and I got them for $8.85. So definitely worth the price. Like I said, these um, these are my usual size, so I got these in a 1X. And these were in, this is a 2, which is definitely big. So if you are ordering it and you want it to be a bit small, more uh, figure friendly, I guess, then definitely order your size or a size down. Probably even a size down. Um, and these order, I would say true to size. Thing I got is another kind of just casual t-shirt. I like all the really pretty things and I keep buying tons of pretty things but to be honest I don't go out a lot. <laughs> I'm a mom. I don't know. I don't have a lot of places to wear them to. Um, besides church and maybe some day nights. I don't know. I probably need more casual clothes but whatever. Anyway so I did pick up another just kind of a casual t-shirt. This is so comfortable. I want to get more. They have different colors and I'm gonna buy some more. This is just a cross strap as you can tell. I like that still whatever. If it's not in anymore I still like it. The little cross strap t-shirt. It's so soft. I don't know what fabric they use but it's so incredibly soft. It has a nice stretch to them. This isn't this is a little bit more closer to the body, it's not as flowy as I'm used to, which I don't mind, but if you want it to be a little bit more flowy, then I would consider sizing up or staying true to size. I wouldn't say it's smaller anyway, um, but it's not necessarily maybe as big as I normally order, but maybe that's probably better for me. <laughs> I got this in a one, and this was originally $14.99, and I paid $9.15 with tax. So I definitely would recommend this. I'm gonna get more of them. I really like them. It'll be perfect for my mom days or when I'm working with leggings, just being comfortable. I really like them. Next, um, I normally like really long, loose fitting things, especially on my tummy area because I still have my mom chub. And I don't like to emphasize it. And I don't like it in crop tops and stuff like that. But for whatever reason, I decided to go crazy and order a bunch of like crop top sort of things and I don't know. I don't know how I feel about them. I don't know how I feel about them yet. But I think this top is gorgeous. I just don't know how flattering it is. Um, it's this really beautiful pink floral kind of just crop top, basically. It's not super cropped. It's not like it's like under my boobs or anything, but it's just, it's not as long as I normally like and it definitely cinches in at the bottom so it's kind of like that like billow kind of area um, but it doesn't give me a whole lot of coverage on the tummy but it is super loose up top I don't know I think it looks really pretty I think it looks really romantic it has the really popular ever so popular bell sleeves which I think is really beautiful it has a nice kind of strap in the back to add a little bit more or something um, it's in that gauzy material it's pretty see-through. It's definitely something you'd have to wear like a nude bra with it um, or like a t uh, even a cami if you don't feel super comfortable with wearing just a bra. Um, it's really, really pretty. It's super lightweight. I think I really like it. I just don't know how I feel about it on myself. So tell me your opinions. I do really like the tassel on the bottom too. I think it's really beautiful. I do think it's really beautiful. Um, this was also in a one and this was $21.99 originally and I paid for it. I paid $11.46. Um, I definitely feel like this one in sizing wise was a bit bigger up top. Um, as you can tell in the try-on haul, it's definitely a bit big on the shoulders and arms. So if you have a bit wider or broader shoulders or bigger arms, I think this would be really nice. Um, but it does cinch in the bottom. It doesn't give a whole lot of extra room in the tummy area. So I thought I would just buy a bunch of mesh and hope for the best. Um, and some things I liked and some things I didn't like. So this is the first thing that I'm definitely not loving. And this is probably the only item in this for me. I did buy my husband a couple things and he liked one item and the other two I'm taking back. Um, this item I think I'll probably take back too. It is kind of another cropped top and it says cropped on line. It wasn't like it surprised me when I got it. But I was just hoping that maybe I could pull it down to be a bit longer. Um, it has a nice give to it. It's mesh. I feel like all of their mesh pieces do have nice give. I don't feel like they're tight or unflattering in that fact. Um, but I just, 
I don't know, I just don't think I can do it. I don't think I can do it. I think this one's a little too sexy for me in a way. I don't know if that makes much sense. It really is pretty. It has that rose applique. Um, however, I did just buy that one from Boohoo that's really similar, and so I don't feel like I can justify two tops. The reason that I really got it was because that it was long sleeve. I just thought that would be pretty. But I just don't think, I don't think I love it on me. So I do think I'm gonna take this back, not because it's a terrible top, but I just don't like it personally on me. Um, I think that the rose apple pay is really nice, and I find it is better than Boohoo's. I find that it's better, like, stitched on than Boohoo's was. Um, like I said, I like the stretch to it. It does have nice give. It has this nice kind of, like, ringer collar almost. Um, but it's just a little too short, in my opinion. This I got in a one, and this was $18.99. All right. So that mesh top was $18.99, and I got it on sale for $9.89. Now this next mesh top I actually really like, and I think it's just because it's still really pretty, and I still think it's kind of sexy, but it's not too form-fitting, has a nice flow about it. I just think it's just a little bit softer, a little bit nicer, nicer, not nicer in quality, I don't know. I don't know, <laughs> um, but it has a bunch of roses on it as well. It's really, really nice and has that same kind of give to it. And of course it has really beautiful bell sleeves. These are pretty dramatic actually, even though they're mesh, they're pretty long, but they look so pretty on. It has that little keyhole in the back. And this one is not as cropped, it's still short but it's not as cropped and it has like a little tie um, at the bottom. It looks really, really pretty on, I think. I just think this is a lot more flattering. Um, and it doesn't, I feel like the crop top maybe just cuts me a little too awkwardly, whereas this doesn't as much. And I just think it's really, really beautiful. So I am keeping this one and I'm taking the other one back. This was $18.99 as well. I'm pretty sure I probably got it for the same price. Uh, $9.77, is that what I got the other one for? 977. So I got that one cheaper. So um, I'm going to keep that one and take the other one back. This next item is also black. I got a lot of black. Pretty much everything I got is almost, if not black, almost everything's black. So forgive me. If you don't like black, you're probably not going to like this. This kind of gives me Beetlejuice vibes. And even though it's not the vertical black and white stripes, I get, I get Be Beetlejuice vibes in it. I don't know. I don't know. I like it though. <laughs> it's this black, um, see-through chiffon kind of material window pane shirt button down it's super long like super super long it way covers your bottom if you want to wear this with leggings i definitely feel like this is something you kind of have to unbutton like i'm the person that really likes to button things up top especially like all the way up especially when i have a pixie i just think it looks cute but i look a little too like like creepy I don't know, like, I don't know how to describe it. I don't, I don't look cute with button all the way up top. I think it needs to, it needs a little bit more femininity, I guess. So I like to unbutton it a bit. Um, I think it's beautiful though. It's nice and breathable. There's not really any give or stretch to this. I mean, that's, I feel like the fabric. Um, but it is flowy, it's cut nicely. I don't feel like it clings. Um, and yeah, I really do like this. This is also $18.99. They do have it in other um, patterns if you don't like the window pane, but I just really like this. Anyway, so I do like this. I think it's really beautiful. Yeah. That was $18.99, and I got that in a one. I think I already said. And I paid probably around, I'm guessing $9 as well. $9.88. So, all right, I did get another romper, mostly because this was on clearance and because I thought maybe I could try and rock this with tights. I love shorts with tights. I think it looks so pretty, like really tailored shorts with tights. I think it looks really nice. So I thought this would look really pretty as well. I did get this in a bigger size because if you guys remember in my last Rue 21 haul, I feel like that one, although fit perfectly fine, I just like my rompers nice and baggy so this is probably a lot baggier than most people like I like baggy clothing I don't know anyway so I got this in a two so it's definitely 
pretty big on me but I really like it so I think if you wanted to get this going with your like same size would be totally fine I feel like I could have gotten my normal size and it would have been just baggy too baggy enough but like I will look crazy anyway it's this black v-neck with floral embroidery tulip romper so it has those kind of like tulip legs but a lot of things now have those like tulip legs but they completely open so you can see your hoo-ha the lady bits or um, show a little bit too much of your leg that you don't feel comfortable with so what I like about this is they still have that kind of lining so it kind of hides it so you're not going to be indecent in any way it's going to hide everything but still give that illusion um, I really like the rompers I think they're really really well made I think they do a really good job with them they fit nicely on the body this has a little back tie as well um, this is in like a gauzy material it's comfortable I really like this. I think this is really, really pretty. And this was originally $26.99, and I want to say I got this for like $8. I got this for $9.35. So crazy good deal. Super excited. They still had it on the website if you guys are interested. I really liked it. It's really nice. And they have such a nice weight. Like, their rompers are so nice. They do a really good job. All right, this is my last mesh item, and of course, it is a yet another black item. Um, this, I don't know why I got so much mesh. <laughs> um, this I really like. This is actually a bit big. I feel like if they had this option in straight sizing, I would have gone to a straight size. So I would size down if that possible. Um, it's a little bit big, but I still really like it. I think this will be really pretty with that black cami underneath. Basically, it's just a black mesh peplum top but I kind of it kind of creates this nice haziness I don't know if that makes any sense over your torso area it looks really pretty if you're someone who likes to wear bralettes or bras with mesh tops I think this one will look really nice with one because it's not super tight fitting where you can see everything about the bra just kind of like lays nicely I just think it's super pretty it has that nice stretch to it as usual um the Sleeves don't are like unfinished in a way like they don't have any sort of lining at the edge It's just kind of like raw mesh, but it still looks so nice This is from a brand called polyester, which I think I've had before from like wet seal when they were still around um, And I have another item from polyester in here, and I've been really impressed with their stuff so far So um, I got this in one like I said I probably would have sized down into straight sizes if it was an option I never checked um, but it's really nice. I really like this. I think this will be so pretty for the holidays um, with like a bright red lip. I just think it was so pretty. So this was originally $21.99. And I got it for $11.44. So I really like that one. Okay, so for the next item from Polyester, um, well, the last item from polyester is this top. Now, crushed velvet is like the new trend I feel like I keep seeing. And so I decided that I would get it. I remember being a kid and like, especially like all my holiday clothes. I remember one particular, I had this like set and it was like a black crushed velvet, um, like little top thing. Like it had like that little fake faux cami underneath with the little cardigan thing that snapped right here and it was all one set you couldn't take it apart and it had bell sleeves and then I had like flare velvet pants that matched. Oh, Christmas when you were a kid and those outfits, man, I thought I was it, man. I was feeling myself when I was eight in that outfit. <laughs> so I get, it gets me excited to wear velvet again. Anyway, um, I think this is really, really pretty. It's, it's actually really surprisingly nice against my skin tone. I, I told you guys before, I don't feel like I look really good in like rosy pinks because I naturally am so fair and pink toned. But I like this because it's just pink enough. I think it is really nice on. I think this is something that's gonna be nice to be able to dress up or dress down. It's comfortable, it's breathable, it's not itchy. Um, then again, if you don't like like that velvet -y crushed fabric feeling like you don't like to I know some people have that feeling where if you like go up against fabric like the velvet it like freaks you out I wouldn't get it I wouldn't get it <laughs> but if you like velvet and like feeling yourself all day um, I it covers nicely it has a high back so I feel like it co gives you a little bit more coverage on the back um, I really like it I feel like it's pretty true to size 
yeah, another another hit. That was in a one as well, and it was $16.99. And I got that for $8.84. Now, the last items are all my favorites. All right, did you hear that? <laughs> now the last items are all my favorites. Um, I saved the best for last. People are upset. Honking their horn. <laughs> terrified to and I'm terrified to wash it and it just be too small so definitely keep that in mind it's just that kind of fabric I feel like um it is 100% rayon and uh, no 100% polyester lining 100% rayon so definitely would shrink I feel like anyway um I got this in a one like I said I don't know if I would size up I like the way it fits my body. I'm just terrified of it shrinking. I don't know. Maybe I'll size up next time and kind of tell you my opinions on that. Um, because I do have this in a couple other different prints as well. If you're not a black person, definitely love it though. Um, this was $24.99. And this was $12.80. So super great. Love this. So happy I got that. Okay. Next to last, well, technically next to last clothing item, but I also have a pair of shoes to talk about at the end. This is probably, I don't know. I don't know, I like all the past three items, my favorite, but this one I'm so excited for. This is gonna be my Christmas dress. I found it so early this year. Normally I'm like shopping like December 23rd for an outfit for Christmas and there's like nothing left and I just look like randomly put together on Christmas Eve. But I'm um, so excited. This is so, pretty to me. It's this bodycon dress with long bell sleeves and the colors are just so pretty. Like look how pretty that red is. It just makes me think of like a fairy tale. I don't know. It has a zipper front so you can wear it as high or low as you want if you want to be a little sexy or if you're going to church and you want to cover up the goods. You know, whatever you want to do on Christmas Eve. I don't know what your life is like. Um, if you want to wear, I mean, you can wear this any time of year. You can, I'm not, you only wear this on Christmas Eve. Anyway, I'm wearing this on Christmas Eve. I think it's so pretty. I was kind of nervous when I ordered this because online, the girl in the picture, for some reason, it looks like it's clinging to her in a really weird way. And I was like, I don't know. I don't normally do bodycon, so I just didn't know. But I went for it, and I'm so glad I did. I got this in my regular size, a one, and... I just think it looks so nice. It's nice and stretchy, definitely has a lot of give to it. So I, I would recommend ordering in your size, but if you don't like bodycon, I wouldn't get it. It's definitely meant to be figure hugging. So if that's not something you're into, I wouldn't get it. Um, but I feel like it has a nice fabric, that really soft, almost velvety fabric that it kind of smooths over everything. I still am gonna wear it with Spanx because I, you know, I want to, oh, lumps and bumps, I want to cover. But I think it's really pretty. I cannot wait to wear this, which is like black tights and like beautiful red burgundy velvety shoes or something. I don't know. I just am so excited. I think this is stunning for the holidays. So love it. 
This was $19.99. They also have it, I want to say, at least in one other, maybe two other prints if you don't like this one. And that was um, $10.30. So absolutely worth that. And this is probably my favorite, although I really like that bell dress and I like the wrap dress. I don't know, I can't make a decision. And this sort of thing I feel like is a love it or hate it item. It's not for everyone I feel like, um, and it is a very much destroyed denim jacket. Now this is from a brand called Hot Kiss. I didn't know up until this purchase that Rue 21 did sell other brands. I thought it was just exclusively like Rue 21. Um, but like I said, I've showed you two items from polyester and I've this item and the shoes are from Hot Kiss. I've been pleasantly surprised with both brands and also Rue 21. Um, and I feel like the sizing is still accurate. I wouldn't say one fits smaller than the other, but just to keep in mind, if you're used to Rue 21 and them kind of being more in the bigger size, maybe order your same size or size up. I don't know, just be aware when you make that purchase. Unfortunately, I don't think it says on the website like this is Hot Kiss jean jacket or something. It'll say, still say Rue 21, but just keep in mind if you're in store or something. Anyway, it's this very distressed, I mean, there's a hole. In it. <laughs> jean jacket and I love it. I had a light wash jean jacket like this when I was a kid and it was from the Gap and I wore it all of the time. I was so excited to see this. Now if you are not someone for this amount of distressing, if you don't like how boyfriend, this is definitely boyfriend fit, very slouchy, if you don't like how big it is, if you don't like the wash, they have a million and one other jean jackets on the website. They have dark wash, light wash, tons of distressing like this, no distressing. I think they even have one that has embroidery on it. If this isn't your cup of tea but you still want a jean jacket, definitely check out the website. They even have cropped ones. I mean, they have all sorts of ones. So I just happen to really, really like this one. I like how distressed it is. I just feel like it's nice and worn, like I've had it since I was a kid. Um, and I'm really happy with it. It's nice and weighty. It is definitely a denim jacket. It's not like a faux denim or anything. Um, that being said, there's not a lot of stretch to this. So I would order your size. But it is very boyfriend slouchy. So it does run on the bigger size. So if you want something that's a tiny bit smaller than size down. But if you like how big and, you know, cozy and boyfriend slouchiness, then I would just order your same size. So... I would not go a size up though. I really love this. I'm so glad I got it. This was $34.99 originally, and I want to say it was the most expensive item that I purchased, but I still got it for $21.37, so more than $10 off anyway. Definitely still worth the price that I got it for. Last but not least, despite my husband's clothes. I got him a character rocket power t-shirt that he did keep and then I bought him a pair of black like slit pant jeans, skinny jeans and a gray like cool marled shirt. All of which were both really big on him. He's naturally really thin but they ran even big even though they're kind of like a junior's guys sizing. So if you're looking for your husband or your brother or your boyfriend, your dad, I don't, I don't know who you're looking for. But if you're looking for a man or if you're a man, um, I feel like the guy clothes, even the character tee, all kind of ran a little bit big. So I wouldn't think about sizing up, even though I feel like on the website everything looks really tight fitting, like for little boys or something. I don't know. Anyway, that's random, but in case you are interested in the men's section, because there is a men's section. Last but not least, I got these pair of booties. I really like them. I think they're super pretty. I got these for such a good price. Um, there are these really beautiful camely brown faux suede booties with these, these are just faux buckles, they don't actually work, um, and they zip on the sides to get in and out. They're actually really comfortable. I wore them today to church and then to Target, so I was walking around quite a bit and I never had a problem. My feet weren't killing me like I thought they would. <sighs> anyway, these are also from the brand Hot Kiss. Uh, the only qualm I would say that I have about these, and it's not the shoe's fault, I feel like with my first kid, um, my oldest, I, my feet never changed, but with my second, my feet, I feel like have widened a bit, but I never noticed because I've been wearing like flip-flops and things that wouldn't really, 
show that my feet got wider but ever since I've been wearing like boots booties and closed toed shoes I can tell that my feet don't fit as comfortably in them um, they're still comfortable but they're a little bit snug in the width department but I don't necessarily feel like these run smaller they just my feet have gotten wider um, they do have a wide shoe section if you have wide feet or if you have larger calves and want boots they do have a section for their that are just wide width shoes so that was that but I do really like these I think they're really pretty they're super comfortable the heel I feel like is like the perfect tie because it still gives you a nice lift but it's not ridiculous I don't know I really like these I feel like I'm going to wear these a lot this fall and I feel like they go with everything so this was originally these were originally $34.99 and I got these for how much were you guys where where are you Nope. These are originally $34.99 and I got them for $12.73 with tax. So absolutely worth it. Shoes normally are always so pricey. So excited. Anyway, so besides my husband's clothes that didn't work out for him and the one mesh shirt that I think I'm going to take back, I feel like everything was a hit. I feel like their consistency is definitely very good. I would absolutely recommend you go check them out now. I recommend them the first time and I definitely recommend them now because I feel like they were totally consistent. Everything I liked I think fit my body for the most part pretty well. Um, I liked everything. I think the quality was great and the prices can't be beat. I feel like I got so many things for such a good price. Like I said, I still recommend shopping online because I feel like you get all the sizes most often available unless they're selling out. Um, and I feel like there's more stuff online and there's also always sales. So I personally would shop online, but if you have a 21 close to you, then go in and kind of scout out sizes. Um, but I, yes, I think I'm going to continue shopping there. I think they've become probably my new favorite store. I feel like they're always adding new stuff to their website as well and updating it. So definitely check back. Not as fast as Boohoo. Boohoo adds stuff so fast, but still pretty fast. So if there's any other plus size stores that you would like me to shop at and film a haul for, then please leave some ideas down below. I've been going on and looking at all the different ones and like Forever 21 and stuff. I feel like Forever 21 is just getting more and more expensive and they never seem to have like actually good sales. So I don't know about Forever 21 anymore. I still like them, but I feel like they're pretty pricey. I don't know, I'm gonna keep I'm gonna keep looking around for you guys. So let me let me know. I also get a lot of stuff from Walmart surprisingly, and I've like this dress is a like cute little bell sleeve dress, and this is from Walmart. It's super cheap. So if you're interested in seeing plus size clothes from them, because I know Walmart's like not normal people's you know favorite place to shop for clothing, then let me know because there's actually a lot of stuff that I really like from them. So. If that's something that interests you, then I will put together some of my favorite stuff that I've gotten over the past couple of months and shoot that for you. So, yep, I think that is about it. Please subscribe and leave a comment below and tell me how you like this video and what you would like to see from this channel. Thank you guys so much for watching and subscribing and just continually coming back. It really means the world to me. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys soon. Bye.